So the new CL, Martin Shreffley, really young, old hedge fund guy, decided to take on this pharmaceutical company. Well, anyways, about a month ago, he bought the drug Daraprim, which used to cost patients $13.50 per pill. Of course, he thought he'd capitalize on the, the niche market that's available for the Daraprim, and he now has it $750 per pill. That's a 5,000% increase. That show that Big Pharma has control over, over the medicine in America. And then Hillary's coming out saying that if she's president, when she become president, she's going to make these people take account for, for what they're doing. Like, like are we really going to wait that far into the next election to have something done about this? Like, this is people lives at risk here. People need this medicine to survive and the current administration is doing nothing about it. Like seven hundred dollars a pill? Seven fifty, I apologize, correction. Seven fifty a pill? Nigga, what? Yeah. These are actually life saving meds for people that get like infections that have cancer or HIV. So definitely need it. And he actually goes on to say that well first he starts running up with a whole bunch of excuses. So he first increased the cost of the pill for and research yeah, and so development. He needs to research for, for new drugs. <laughs> Well, now for starters, how about we just eliminate these pharmaceuticals and legalize hemp? Where the hemp comes, a turn of medicine. THC cures cancer, my nigga. Come on, proven fact. Proven fact. Anyway, he is part of New Money Big America. He uh, actually was not apologetic about it at all. No, 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 not at all. On wrong. Twitter, he actually quoted from Eminem's song, I Am the Way, the way I Am. Saying he was giving the press the middle finger in so many words. So, you know, but after much criticism, as they always do, he tries to blame it on the election as the reason why he's getting so much press about it. But he said they're going to review it in the next few weeks to see if maybe they can bring the cost down a little bit. Yeah, so he at least breaks even or make a little bit of profit. But if you really care about people's lives, you wouldn't really care about profit if that was the case. But no, no, they don't care about people's lives. No, no. By the way, Black Lives Matter.